for a junior high matchup between Fox Chapel and Newcastle. We're preempting Newswatch Weekend Edition to bring you junior high football. Fox Chapel, Newcastle has won the toss and will defer to the second half. So Fox Chapel will receive and defend the south goal. Fox Chapel in the white shirts and black pants. Newcastle in their traditional black shirts, red pants. And we're just moments away from the kickoff. We will bring you, during the course of the game, people who made this possible, our sponsors, and also updates from last night's action around Lawrence County and the high school circuit. Newcastle will kick off defending the north goal. I believe they will be keeping the clock right now. The clock might be being kept on the field. Oh, they just set it to eight minutes. So we are ready to go here with junior high football action. And there's whistle and There's the start of the game. Kick travels to the 45-yard line. And that's where the Fox Chapel Foxes will take over. Last night, exciting action here at Taggart Stadium as the Newcastle Red Hurricane were victorious over Char Valley 29-28 Fox Chapel splits one to each side wings to each side one back set motion near side full back through he's gonna pick up a good seven yards it's gonna bring up Second, and we'll call it three. Ball resting at the Hurricane 47. It's a Fox Chapel breaks the huddle. One to each side, motion to the near side. Snap, handoff, and fullback moves the pow and carries the first down for Fox Chapel. Ball now resting, first and 10 on the 43-yard line. One to each side, motion away. Fullback carries right side. And he's going to pick up three yards. And it's going to be second and seven for Fox Chapel. little chilly morning here 43 degrees under a cloudy sky Fox Chapel steps up to the line second and seven one to each side wing motions to near side and 
that's going to be a pickup of another three yards, making it third and four yards to go. 5.36 on a moving clock in the first quarter. These are eight-minute quarters for junior high football. Fox Chapel breaks the huddle. Once again, splits one to each side. Wing on each side. One back set. Motion to the near side. Pitch to the fullback. And he picks up the first down and steps out at the 25-yard line. Newcastle 25-yard line. That will be a first and 10 for Fox Chapel. First and 10, Fox Chapel at the Newcastle 25. Fox Chapel moving the ball. We're just under five minutes in this first quarter. One split to each side. Under center, motion away. And fullback straight ahead. And he stopped for no gain. That'll bring up second and ten. Rain begins to fall here at Taggart Stadium. As I was sitting here, <laughs> I heard a little sizzle you can't really tell looking through the camera lens but we're getting a, a nice downpour Fox Chapel breaks the huddle same set they're working out of one base quarterback under center motion away counter doesn't fool the Canes who stopped the ball carrier after a one yard pickup. It's going to be third and call it eight for Fox Chapel. Rain actually blowing from left to right on your screen. And coming down pretty good right now. Motion away. Fox Chapel in shotgun. Quarterback rolls right. And the pass is complete. Pass complete. That's a first down. Play good for another Fox Chapel first down. Ball's resting on the 14-yard line. At the Newcastle 14. And there's our friendly post. First and 10 from the 14. And a nice rain falling at, as it comes down harder. Fox Chapel breaks the huddle. Sends one to each side. Look for the fullback to carry this. Motion near side. That's a carry by the fullback. A pickup of three. Going to bring up second and seven for Fox Chapel. We apologize for the post. Fox Chapel is going to split one to each side, a wing to each side, same set. We'll work with this post here. They got a flag 
We have a flag on Fats Chapel. Looks like they're going to call holding on Fox Chapel. That was a pickup of three yards. Rain coming down. Really good now as people come under the roof. Penalty bought backs of foxes up to the 20 yard line. Where it'll be second down and call it 17. Motion near side. Pitch to the to the fullback and he stopped at the 19 yard line. Third, still call it 17. Rain has eased up a little. Two to the near side, wing and wide out to the far side. Shotgun. Passes down to the five yard line. But that's not going to be enough for the first down. And a timeout is called. Timeout called by Newcastle, and after that brief break, Fox Chapel comes back to the line of scrimmage, split one to each side, wing on each side, fullback. Wouldn't be surprised if they try and go straight at the Canes right here. Long count, and timeout Fox Chapel. Tried to pull the Canes off sides there. Canes refused to jump. And Fox Chapel calls another timeout. Now it is fourth and two, and call it a long two. Ball sitting between the six and seven yard line. Fox Chapel having to get to the three for the first down inside the four, not quite to the three. Fox Chapel breaks the huddle, sends wides to both sides. Wing on both sides, full back, quarterback under center. Full back carries. And he's gonna be short of the first down. Canes stop the Foxes on fourth and three. Newcastle will take over at its own five yard line. Newcastle takes over first and ten. Canes on the snap. Bobble the ball. Loss of four. Makes it second and 14. There's a stoppage in play as they bring in a dry ball. I can't uh, begin to tell you how much rain we're getting right now. Here we are, shotgun. Why not split to both sides? K 
carry out. Picks up two yards. And that's going to be the quarter. With the score. Fox Chapel, nothing. Newcastle, nothing. We'll be back with the second quarter. As we start the second quarter, it's third down and 12 for the Canes. Ball resting on the three. And pass falls incomplete. Canes will likely have to punt with it being fourth and 12. Ball resting on the three yard line. Canes in pump formation. There's a snap and kick. Ball rolls dead, and I'm checking out the spot. Looks like the 16 yard line. Where it'll be first and 10 for Fox Chapel. Play comes in for Fox Chapel. We'd like to thank our sponsors, Augustine's Italian Village, Beanery Depot and Deli, Bill's Bake Shop, Butts Flowers and the Crane Room. Two to the far side, one to the near side, motion to the near side. Fullback pitch. And he picks up five yards. They'll mark the ball at the 10 and pick up a six, actually. That It'll be second right and four. Also sponsoring this podcast, DiCaprio Cleaning, Joshua Sun Rehab, Lanigan's Irish Pub, Little Johnny's 2, Latin Auto Repair, McCree Sports, Main Street Clothiers. One to each side and one wing to each side. Shotgun for the Foxes. They split the wing out now. Motion away. Fullback carries. Stopped by the Canes. We'll wait for the spot, but he crossed the 10 yard line. Ball not quite resting on the nine. They're going to keep it at third and four. Canes definitely have two stops that they need left in them. We'd also like to thank Two P's Thrifts and Gifts, Westminster College, and Leslie Sansone to walk at home. Fox Chapel comes out, splits one to each side, slot on the near side, and shotgun formation. Tackled at the five yard line. And that's going to be first and goal. Rocco Robinson on the stop. And we got first and goal from the five for Fox Chapel. 5.49 on a moving clock. First and goal for Fox Chapel. Fox Chapel breaks the huddle. They send one to each side. And they bring a wing to the right and slot to the left. Shotgun. 
wide open and he dropped it. Penalty marker on the play. I'm looking ineligible downfield against Fox Chapel. I, I don't believe they'll accept that. They did. Backed it up five yards. Making a first and goal from the ten. Fox Chapel sends two to the far side, one to the near side, wing near side, shotgun. Quarterback switches with a slot. Ball bouncing around after a high snap. Canes stop and thwart the play. Ball will be resting at the 19, where it will be second and 19 for Fox Chapel. 4.38 on a moving clock. In action last night, Newcastle 29, Chartiers Valley 28. Giving the Canes a spot in the WPL playoffs. High snap again. Ball's fumbled. Recovered by Fox Chapel. Ball now will rest at the 21 yard line, where it will be third and 21. Fox Chapel sends two to the far side, slot one to the near side. Shotgun, high snap, ball caught, will bring up fourth and five at the five. In other action last night. Laurel 27, Elwood 14, Western Beaver 27, Union 20, Shenango 45, Riverside 21, Wilmington 19, Lakeview nothing, Nashanik 49, Char Houston 14, and we already gave you that Newcastle score, Newcastle 29. Chartiers Valley 28. Now, as we have a timeout on the field, we'd like to thank our sponsors, Augustine's Italian Village, Beanery Depot and Deli, Bill's Bake Shop, Butts Flowers, Crane Room Bar and Grill, DiCaprio Cleaning, Dr. Wrightson and Joshua Rehabilitation, Lanigan's Irish Pub, Little Johnny's 2, Lutton Auto Repair and Crazy Car Connection, McCree Sporting Goods, Main Street Clothiers, Two Piece Thrifts and Gifts, Westminster College, and Leslie Sansone walking home. 313, fourth and five for Fox Chapel. They split one to each side, motion away, shotgun. And there's the snap. Quarterback rolls left. And that's a touchdown for Fox Chapel. Three oh seven on the clock as Fox Chapel takes a six nothing lead over the Canes.
definitely a chilly day. Actually felt warmer last night. Fox Chapel lines up and goes for two. Shotgun formation. Motion to the near side. Quarterback rolls left. And the extra point attempts is no good. In the first half, the score of Fox Chapel 6, Newcastle 0. With 3.07 left, Fox Chapel 6, Newcastle 0 as we head upfield. This is NCTV 45, where you can watch us anytime on your time. And this is a special presentation of NCTV 45 Sports. This is Junior High Football, Newcastle versus Fox Chapel from Taggart Stadium. We have 3.07 left in the second quarter. Fox Chapel leads 6-0. Canes to get the ball. Fox Chapel now lining up for the kick. We have a whistle and a stoppage. And I'm not quite sure. I don't see a flag on the field. I guess the officials weren't ready. <laughs> Here we go again. And ball stopped. Ball is down by Jordan Holland. And it'll be first and ten canes. As I search for the spot, 43 yard line. Canes split one to each side. I formation. Second back through. Bounces to the outside, but is stopped. Picks up two yards. 2.52 on the clock. I'm running. Ball on the 45 yard line. Eight yards to go for the first down. Canes in no huddle. Split out one to each side. Slot to the near side. Shotgun for the Canes. Motion away. Big night, the ball carrier. Big night. Loses a yard. Bring up third and nine. Canes break the huddle, sending a wide out to each side. Wing, far side, shotgun. Daniel better not pass to Jaden Daniels. Falls incomplete. They roll incomplete on the pass. And that'll bring up fourth and nine.
149 on the clock. Kane's going for it with fourth and nine. Quarterback rolls left. Daniel Menenok on the scamper. And he's going to pick up the first down. There is a penalty marker, however, on the play. Flag thrown in the backfield. And I, I didn't catch the call. I believe it was holding. It's not, uh, it's a fourth, and I think you might have heard the public address announcer. Canes have to get to the 47 yard line. So, ball resting on the 30. So it's fourth and 23 for Newcastle. A minute 39 left till halftime. Kane's trailing 6 0. We'd like to thank our sponsors, Augustine's Italian Village and the Beanery Depot in Delhi. Bill's Bake Shop in Mahuntingtown, Butts Flowers, Crane Room, Bar and Grill, DiCaprio Cleaning, Joshua Sun Rehabilitation. Kane's line up in pump formation. Snap back to Birdie Fabian. Ball caught. And Fox Chapel will take over on the Newcastle 41 yard line. Also, thanks to Lanigan's Irish Pub, Little Johnny's 2, Lutton Auto Repair and Crazy Car Restoration, McCree's Sporting Goods, Main Street Clothiers and Tailors. Two Peas Thrifts and Gifts, Westminster College, and Leslie Sansome's Walk at Home. Fox Chapel splits one out to each side. Slot near side, shotgun for the Fox Chapel Foxes. And it's going to be a pass. As a quarterback was hit on the release, the ball falls incomplete which will make it second and ten for Fox Chapel. Kane's put a nice rush there on Fox Chapel. Fox Chapel huddling extraordinarily far away from the ball. They're almost back 15 to 20 yards. They break the huddle, send one to each side, slot to the far side, wing near side. Shotgun. Pass. Quarterback in trouble, and he sacked. Tackle by Austin Leisure. Ball resting on the Hurricane 46 yard line. Making it third and 15. 56 seconds on a moving clock. Fox Chapel sends a play into the game.
Fox Chapel breaks the huddle. And there's a flag. Delay a game on Fox Chapel. Delay a game against Fox Chapel. That's going to back him up five yards. Thirty two point five seconds left. Fox Chapel calls the play and they're up to the line. Wing and slot to both sides. Timeout, Fox Chapel. Thirty two point five seconds left. We haven't gotten a playoff, but we've gotten a couple penalties. We'd like to thank our sponsors, Augustine's Italian Village, Beanery Depot and Deli, Bill's Bake Shop, Butts Flowers, Crane Room Bar and Grill, DiCaprio Cleaning, Joshua Sun Rehabilitation, Lanigan's Irish Pub, Little Johnny's 2, Lutton Auto Repair and Crazy Car Restoration, McCree Sporting Goods, Main Street Clothiers, Two Piece Thrifts and Gifts, Westminster College for their kind and help with NCTV 45, and Leslie Sansone's Walk at Home. This is NCTV 45 bringing you junior high football. We've preempted all our news watch and a happy sweetest day to you. Fox Chapel sends one's each side, wing the near side, slot the far side, shotgun. Fox Chapel running the end around. There's a penalty. It's going to be a hold on Fox Chapel. That's going to back them up if the Canes take it. I would be surprised. Penalties decline. That's going to make it a fourth down. Now it's fourth and call it 20. Question is will Fox Chapel punt? They, they start the clock. Canes have one timeout, but Fox Chapel up to the line. And that's going to make the clock expire with our halftime score. And that's the end of the first half. What's the score? Fox Chapel 6. Fox Chapel 6. Newcastle zero, and that's the half. As we get ready to start the second half here at Taggart Stadium, the rain has stopped momentarily. Fox Chapel winning this contest thus far, 6 nothing. as it's the Fox Chapel Junior High versus Newcastle. If you just joined us, Fox Chapel in the white shirts and black trousers and Newcastle in the black shirts and red trousers. We'd like to thank our sponsors, Augustine's Italian Village, The Beanery, Depot and Deli, Bill's Bake Shop, Butts Flowers, Crane Room Bar and Grill, DiCaprio Cleaning, Joshua Sun Rehabilitation, Lanigan's Irish Pub, Little Johnny's 2, Lutton Auto Repair and Crazy Car Restoration, McCree Sports, and Main Street, Clothier and Tailors. Two-Piece Thrifts and Gifts, Westminster College, and Leslie Sansone Walk at Home. Now the Canes deferred to the second half. So Fox Chapel will 
kick, and we're underway with that second half. Ball bounces. Ball on the kickoff. Fox Chapel claiming they have the ball, and they do. The rain was stopped during halftime, and now has begun again. Fox Chapel will have the ball first and 10 on the Newcastle 47. Chain gang moving a little slow here. <laughs> Fox Chapel comes to the line. They split out one to each side. Wing on each side, fullback. Expect to see the fullback straight ahead. We've seen this formation before, and there he goes. That's a pickup of a first down as Fox Chapel crosses the 35 to the 33 yard line where it will be first and 10. Fox Chapel sends one to each side, wing on each side. Fullback set. Center trap run by Fox Chapel. And they're going to call him down on the one yard line. Tackle on the play made by Austin Leisure. First and goal from Fox Chapel on the one yard line. 7 12 early in the third quarter. Missed falling. Fox Chapel to the line, split one out on each side and wing on each side. Look for the fullback here. And quarterback sneak scores. 12 0 Fox Chapel with 646 as they will attempt the extra point. was amazing that the rain had stopped the rain had stopped just before <laughs> the uh, start of halftime and began at the start of the third quarter quarterback under center full back through and that's the two-point conversion. So as we head upfield, it is Fox Chapel 14, Newcastle nothing. Last night in high school football action, Newcastle. 29, Chartiers Valley 28, giving the Canes a berth in the WPL playoffs. The Shanick 49, Chartiers Houston 14, Wilmington 19, Lakeview nothing. Shenango 45, Riverside 21, Western Beaver 27, Union 20, and Laurel 27, Elwood 14. Canes need to hang on to the ball here. And with the speed that uh, they've exhibited all year, they could be in this ball game in one short return. Fox Chapel 
Fox Chapel approaches. There's the kick. Ball selling over the head. And down on the 25 yard line. Wet field, he slid into, like sliding into second, he slid into the ball to recover it. Better to be safe than sorry. And Canes take over, first and 10 on the 25. Fox Chapel in. Carrier stopped. Loss of, call it, four and a half. Bringing up second and 15. Kane sent to the far side. Wing the far side. Quarterback rolls. Pass complete to Klingon Smith. Moving the ball out to the 31. Canes approach the, the ball. No huddle. Sand. Trips to the far side. Mennonock on the carry. And I believe they're going to spot the ball on the 33 yard line, bringing up fourth and two. Trips to the far side again. Minnenock sacked. It'll be first and ten for Fox Chapel. With 5.16 on the clock and Fox Chapel Holding on to a 14 nothing lead. Fox Chapel breaks the huddle. Sending one to each side. Wing to each side. Quarterback under center. Fullback set. Basically, Fox Chapel running out of the same set almost every down. And it is second and five. Four forty seven on a moving clock, and we're in the third quarter. Second and five for Fox Chapel. Ball looked like, seemed to be bobbled by the quarterback there for a second. He pulls it down. Rocco Robinson on the stop as the quarterback picks up two yards. It's going to be third and three. Rain still continues to fall here at Taggart on this Saturday morning. Happy sweetest day to you. Hope you plan on doing something later with your sweetheart. Motion to the left. 
fullback carries left side. Needs him for the score. Giving Fox Chapel a 20 to 0 lead as we prepare for the extra point. Ball on a three, Fox Chapel, same formation. Wing on each side, split out on each side, full back. Full back stopped. And as we go upfield. Twenty. Fox Chapel leading twenty nothing with 3.29 the third. Canes need to hang on to the ball here under these conditions with the rain falling. They've bobbled it quite a bit. A little nippy out today too. Come to the stadium check the weather back at the station it was 43 degrees we didn't get the rain till just at kickoff and then it rained the first half took a break at halftime and the rain now falling in the second half Fox Chapel tees the ball up. And tackled at call at the 35 yard line. It'll be first and 10 for the Kings. Three twenty four on the clock. Kings trail. 20 to nothing. Canes come to the line, split out one to each side, I formation. Men in all candles to McKnight. And McKnight picks up six. Makes it second and four. Keynes with the same set. We'll see where they spot that. I believe he lost a yard, bringing up third and five. Kane split out one to each side. Motion to the near side. Mennonock recovers. We have a flag. 2.30 left in the third. We'd like to thank our sponsors. Augustine's Italian Village, Beanery Depot and Deli, Bill's Bake Shop, Butts Flowers, Crane Room, DiCaprio Cleaning, Joshua Sun Rehabilitation, Lanigan's Irish Pub, Little Johnny's 2. Canes to the line. Fumble on the play, recovered by Fox 
Fun ball on the play, recovered by Fox Chapel. Fox Chapel will take over first and ten. Ball's going to rest on the 23 yard line. Lynn against Irish Pub. Little Johnny's 2. McCree Sporting Goods. Main Street Clothiers. Two Piece Thrifts and Gifts. Just to name a few of our sponsors making this telecast possible. Fox Chapel under center. Hand off to the fullback. Who picks up a couple. Special thanks to Westminster College and Leslie Sansone. So walk it home. It's a second and seven with a minute 40 on a moving clock. Fox Chapel up to the line. Quarterback under center. Counter. Holding against Fox Chapel. Going to nullify the game. After the mark off, ball will be placed on the 33 yard line, bringing up second and 20. Fox Chapel to the lines. One to either side, wing to either side. Motion near side. Full back. Back on the play made by Rocco Robinson. Rocco Robinson on the tackle. Fox Chapel picking up ten. We'll make it third and ten. Nineteen seconds on a moving clock. Four. Fox Chapel to the line. One. And that's going to do it. For the third quarter, Fox Chapel 20, Newcastle 0. As we head upfield, let's take one more thank to our sponsors, Leslie Sansone's Walk at Home. Special thanks to Westminster College for their support. Two-piece thrifts and gifts. Main Street Clothiers and Tailors, McCree Sports, Lot and Auto Repair and Crazy Car Restoration, Little Johnny's 2 downtown, Lanigan's Irish Pub and Eatery, Joshua Sun Rehabilitation in the Shannock, Dupree, DiCaprio Cleaners, Crane Room Bar and Grill, Butts Flowers, Bill's Bake Shop, Beanery Depot and Deli, and Augustine's Italian Village. NCTV 45, always happy to bring you local programming. On a cold, damp Saturday at Taggart Stadium, it's junior high football as the Canes find themselves trailing 20 to nothing with eight minutes to go in the game as we start the fourth quarter. 
Fox Chapel has the ball if you've just joined us Fox Chapel splits out one to each side quarterback under center motion away full back through and stopped we're going to call it the 21 yard line bringing up fourth long nine we'll call it ten happy sweetest day to you as we send out a greetings to all watching especially the mums and the girlfriends. Fox Chapel splits out one to each side. Wing on each side and full back set. Fox Chapel hasn't varied from this. Of course it's junior high so you can't get too complex. Counter, inside counter and balls carried into the end zone. Ball placed on the three. 65, six minutes, 55 seconds. Fox Chapel with a 26 nothing lead. They break the huddle and come up for the extra point attempt. Quarterback under center. There's a snap. Full back straight ahead. And it's good. Fox Chapel 28. Newcastle 0, 6.55 left in the fourth. In college action later today, Notre Dame travels to Tallahassee to take on Florida State in a battle of two unbeatens. Fox Chapel to kick. As we wait to kick off. Fox Chapel lined up and we're ready to kick at 6.55 left in the fourth. Ball well done by Rocco Robinson. Rocco Robinson catches it as he dives. Catches it, ball spotted on the 49 yard line. First and 10. Split one to each side. Here comes McKnight into the game. There's a flag. Flag on the play. I believe they're going to call motion. (laughs) 
640 on the clock. Five-yard penalty, illegal procedure against Newcastle. Canes break the huddle, sending one to each side. Shotgun for Newcastle. Jaden carries the ball on the right side. Jaden Daniels carries for the first down, moving the ball down to the 32. Canes will take over first and 10 at the Fox Chapel 32 yard line. Split one out to each side, I formation shotgun. Stopped in the backfield for no gain. 6.15 as the clock's moving. Kane split out one to each side. I formation again. Fumble on the play, recovered by Fox Chapel. It's first and ten for Fox Chapel at their 48-yard line. Check that, 44. First and ten for Fox Chapel on the 44-yard line. Fox Chapel comes up under center. After a pickup of four, second and six. Five twenty four on a moving clock. Fox Chapel holding a twenty eight point lead, twenty eight nothing, as they break the huddle. One split to each side. Fullback carry. Rocco with the tackle. Tackle on the play made by Rocco Robinson. Penalty marker on the play. And they have holding against Fox Chapel. That's going to make it second and eighteen. For Fox Chapel. Fox Chapel comes up under center. Fullback tries the left side and is out to the 46 yard line. That's going to make it third. They spot it on the 45. That's going to make it third and eight.
Fox Chapel up to the line. Fullback. Three forty eight on the running clock. Fourth and ten. Fox Chapel breaks the huddle. They're in pump formation. Flag. Delay a game. That'll back them up five yards, make a fourth and 15. Ball will be placed on the Fox Chapel 38 yard line. Snap. Fox Chapel gets the punt away. And Kane's fumble, giving Fox Chapel the ball. Ball's going to be placed on the 31 yard line. Newcastle 31. I was looking at the official. He now has his earlugs ear down as the chill sets in a little bit here on damp cold Saturday morning. Fox Chapel under center. Fumble bounces back up into Fox Chapel players' hands. And there's really not too much you can say or do about that. As the ball is advanced out to the 15-yard line, called 16. A fumble on the play. And Kane dives at the ball. The ball shoots up in the air into the arms of a waiting fox who brings the ball down to the Newcastle 16. Canes on defense. Fox Chapel breaks the huddle. First and 10. Ball resting on the 16 yard line. Fumble again. And we'll take a look. Newcastle recovers. Ball will rest on the 20 yard line. Will be first and 10 canes with two minutes to go in the game. Canes and shotgun, straight ahead run. Midnight on the run, and he stopped for a three-yard loss. We have a penalty marker on the play. There's 151 left in the ball game. Would like to thank our sponsors, Leslie Sansone's Walk at Home, Westminster College for their fine technical support, Two Peas Thrifts and Gifts, Main Street Clothiers, 
McCree Sporting Goods, Lawton Auto Repair and Crazy Car Restoration, Little Johnny's 2, Lanigan's Irish Pub, Joshua Sun Rehab, DiCaprio Cleaning, Crane Room, Bar and Grill, there's the snap. And stopped for a loss. Ball will rest on the 23. Butts Flowers. Bill's Bake Shop. Beanery Depot and Deli. And Augustine's. Italian Village. 115 on the clock. Canes and shotgun. Hand off to McKnight. McKnight the ball carry. McKnight stopped. Bring up third down. Call it 23. Thirty-eight seconds. Ball snap, roll right, ball falls incomplete. Fourth down with 24.6 seconds left in the ball game. That's going to be encroachment on Fox Chapel. That'll take uh, five off that 25 to go. <laughs> That'll make it fourth and 20. With 23.2 seconds on the clock. Snap. Fumbled. 16.3 seconds left as Fox Chapel takes over on downs. Split out to both sides. Gonna take a knee here, would expect. And that's going to do it for this junior high game. NCTV 45, happy to bring it to you. Fox Chapel 28, Newcastle 0. NCTV 45, always happy to bring you local action, whether it be sports. Arts, news, or any time on your time. That's going to do it here from Taggart Stadium with the score. Fox Chapel 28, Newcastle 0. Thanks for watching Junior High Football.